Hello and welcome to Enor's series on web analytics. Today's topic is introduction to Google Analytics and this is Faris Alhalu, president and co-founder of Enor. Um, a couple of commonly asked questions about the slides and about the webinar. We will have both the slides and the webinar available on our site www.e-nor.com uh, for you to download a view on demand. As far as the agenda for today, we'll have an introduction, then we'll go over the benefits as well as the features for Google Analytics, and we will have some sample reports uh, that will show you the power of Google Analytics and what you can do for your site and for your business, and we will have some time for a Q&A. Um, one slide on the company, our marketing team would like us to uh, just say a few things about Enor. Uh, we're out of Santa Clara, California, uh, been in business for six years. Uh, also, we're, uh, as you can tell, we are a Google Analytics authorized consultant company. We are a qualified Google advertising company. Uh, we work with Yahoo as well and MSN. We are into usability and um, web and graphic design, and we are active in the web analytics space. Um, a couple of things before I start the topic about references and resources. These are some of the books that we benefited from. Um, they're really good from both from a technical perspective as well as from a marketing perspective. Uh, so you can find those online at uh, Amazon or, or you can buy from other places. Uh, Advanced Web Metrics uh, with Google Analytics by Brian Clifton as well as the other couple of books here we have um, on Google Analytics. Uh, you can also check our website and our blog, inor.com slash blog uh, for um, updated information on, on internet marketing in general and also on web analytics. Uh, other references, uh, the Google Analytics site, uh, google.com slash analytics, as, as well as the Google Conversion University. A lot of, lot of uh, case studies, uh, articles by industry gurus, you'll find it very useful. And there's the also, there's the, the Google Analytics group. Uh, if you have some specific question, you can go on that group and, and, and ask your questions. So Google Analytics, why? <laughs> let me you know. Let me start off with this. You know, do you have question? Do you have answers to these these questions? You know, do you know where your website visitors are coming from? Uh, once we have visitors that, that come to the site, do we know what they're doing? Are they engaged? Are they buying? Are they downloading this white paper? Are they uh, downloading a coupon? Are they viewing the video that you've invested so much into? Uh, do we know? Do we know answers to these questions? Uh, do we know which keywords? If you're buying uh, keywords on, on AdWords or, or on Yahoo or you're doing some organic search engine optimization, do you know what keywords people are typing to come to, to your site? That, you know, what, what's driving traffic to your site? Um, if we have an e-commerce site and we have a, a, you know, a cart and we have somebody who comes to the site maybe and they add to cart and but they never go and, and buy. We know we find that we're bringing so we're spending so much money on on driving traffic to the site, but unfortunately, our conversion rates are very low. People are just not checking out. So if we don't know why, to those questions, and as well as you know our marketing campaigns, do we know which campaigns are most effective? We know am I getting the right ROI on this campaign? Or am I get, getting some something that is that is below average? You know, do I know out of those three or four or five campaigns I'm running, do I know which one is, is really outperforming the others? So those and other questions can and should be answered um, and should be available to you as as a business owner, as a VP of marketing, as you know, as a webmaster sometimes in a smaller companies that that end up he or she might be wearing a lot of hats and they have to answer to the executive team on what's going on on the website. So, you know, with a web analytics tool such as Google Analytics, you can have answers to these questions. You can even have answers to a lot, other a lot of other questions that, um, that you wouldn't have ac access to otherwise. So, you know, wh what can we do? You know, we can obviously, especially, especially for a site that's that's starting to spend for a business that, that is starting to spend on marketing, we want to understand the return on investment. We want to understand, you know, if I'm doing search engine marketing, if I'm paying a lot of dollars to Google for, you know, on AdWords, uh, I want to understand the return on, on, on those dollars. I want, to, I want to be able to look at the traffic that's coming from, from my organic um, marketing campaign and see if it's really 
converting into business. I want to be able to, to look at my banner ads. If I'm running banners on other sites, um, I want to see which, which banners are bringing traffic to my site. And out of, out of those banner campaigns, which are really um, bringing traffic that's engaging with, with what I'm offering. I also want to look at uh, other sites, you know, referring sites, sites that bring traffic um, to our business here. Uh, which of these links, which which of these refer referring refer traffic is actually quality traffic? Um, I'm sending newsletters. I'm sending email uh, uh, email um, newsletters. I'm sending email um, promotions. I'm I'm using email to in to sort of nurture my my relationship with my clients. But are people opening these emails? And if they are opening these emails, are they really clicking and coming to my site? And if they are coming to my site, are they doing what, what I want them to do? Are they finding what they're looking for? Those are the th kind of questions that will be answered by having a proper implementation of, of Google Analytics. Now, what are the benefits of the tool? What, what are the benefits of Google Analytics? There are a few that we've listed here, and you can find more details at the URL shown on the screen. But basically, the tool is free. It's, it costs you nothing. You can just spend your time and effort and money on marketing, on analysis, but you can get the tool for free. Just go to google.com slash analytics and, and open up an account. Uh, the analytics it provides is, is very sophisticated. You can, you can find, you know, as we discussed earlier, you can have uh, some high-end analytics offering available to you at no cost. Very easy to use. You can copy and paste a very a uh, very small piece of code on your site. Your webmaster can help you, or you can have a comp some outsources to someone else. But you can very easily upload the code, have it on your website, and be ready to um, uh, to start collecting useful data. It's also scalable. The tool is hosted um, on Google servers, and and you can scale up. You can have um, a huge amount of, of, of visitors or page views. Those are some of the concerns that sometimes we hear. You know, how scalable is the tool? It's very scalable, very safe as well. Uh, Google has a, an industry-leading privacy policy, and you can find more information about the privacy policy on, the privacy policy on, 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 on Google site. Um, but your information is uh, safeguarded and, and it's protected. So, so those are some of the benefits. You know, what are some of the features? Um, as we said, very easy to implement. You get the code, you put it on your site, you start collecting data. Now, you can start com comparing campaigns. As we said, search, you know, marketing. If you're doing paid versus non-paid, if you're doing Yahoo and Google, if you're doing um, other type campaigns, email campaigns, you can compare each campaign and see how how the return on investment is working for you. Um, custom dashboards, and we'll show you some examples where you can create cast dashboards for your webmasters, dashboards for your executive team. You can easily create multiple dashboards that can be emailed to you um, at, uh, at, a, at the time uh, that you specify. If you are a heavy AdWords user, uh, this is probably one of the, one of the most appealing bene benefits and features of, of, of Google Analytics is, is there is no integration. There is no, uh, you don't have to worry about extra tagging or importing um, uh, cause data, all of that with a couple of configuration buttons. Uh, you can have all your AdWords data in, imported to, to Google Analytics. The internal site search, you know, once you, if you have an on-site search, you know, you want to know what people are typing, what people are searching for. This helps us understand the intent of the visitor. So we can track that with Google Analytics. E-commerce e tracking. Um, one big section on e-commerce um, with a lot of useful reports that are available to you. Uh, funnel, you can, I'll show you an example of what a funnel could look like and how you could improve your visitor to, to buyer ratio. Geotargeting, which geographies are bringing you quality users? Which geographies are lucrative for you uh, so you can focus on and which are not and you know what we can do about that. Uh, you can have uh, your reports, nice PDF, nice Excel or CSV type reports uh, and XML reports sent to you on a periodic basis, very easily to configure, very easy to, to show those reports in, in your inbox.